Hi guys, look at my nails. But today we are doing a maintenance day because I told you I'm gonna be getting ready to go to Atlanta. Everything last minute, everything ghetto, everything hood. Pink lemonade with the bomb, babe. Make the booty up, oh, like Beyonce. How can make the dick dance, rock it like a blast, and you want another chance? But I know we won't last, and your last bitch mad because I'm coming up fast. I'm passing bitches up like they're running out of Because why is it the day before I'm leaving, I'm going to get my eyelashes done, and I'm going to get my nails done? So, yeah, I'm going to do that. I probably. I'm not gonna lie, I'm really not gonna take y'all because I it's this camera. I got a big old camera now. I'm not gonna take y'all, but yeah. So I'll let you know when I get back from getting my situations, everything done, my brows, my I mean my um lashes and my nails are at three, so I'll be back after my lash appointment to show y'all. And we'll do a little bit of packing as well. When I tell y'all this camera lens is gonna be the death of me. Okay, I need to get a new one. It be turning purple and pink the whole screen. Good morning. It is Thursday, January 26th. Here got my lashes. Whoa! Whoa! Yeah. And then here got my nails. Whoa! Yeah. And I'm gonna fix my hair. And I already packed some, but I'm gonna pack some more. Um, yeah, I already packed some, but I'm gonna pack some more or whatever. And um, get it together, get it together. I already have been up and brushed my teeth and everything, but I sleep with the fan on, so I'm still working through that. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I'm gonna be back to let y'all see when I pack and stuff. But like I said, my camera has been acting a fool, so. I need to go get my toes done and my eyebrows. Um, so yeah, probably gonna do that. And then, yeah. I ain't gonna take y'all there. I'll take y'all there. But yeah, I'm not gonna take y'all there, but, cause I have the camera on like this tripod right now, like this handheld thing. And um, I don't know, it's big as hell. Like girl, don't nobody wanna carry this shit. But yeah, so that's what it's giving for today. I leave today. I fly out today. So, you know, I'm going to take y'all to the airport and everything. And, you know, we're going to be outside together. We're going to be chilling. But I'm going to try to protect this lens, baby, because the lens do what it please. The lens do as it, as it pleases. But we need the lens to do right. We need the lens to complete its job or this trip because I actually am going to vlog. I'm actually very excited. I'm actually ready, okay? So we need it to work. So it's gonna work, y'all. Cause this is it's a little broke, but I think I just gotta turn it to a certain part and then it be doing what it needs to do. But yeah, so I will check back in with y'all a little bit later. I'm gonna get my toes and stuff done, but yeah, I'm checking y'all later. Mine. Hi guys. So I took my hair down or whatever. And um Um, yeah, so I just got done trying to redo my bags and pack all my stuff and everything, which was good, went over good, which I'm happy about. I'm really sad that I got to check my luggage, but I feel like it's my fault. I don't think I locked it last time, so hopefully, because when I went to Miami last time, I checked my luggage under the plane or whatever, and girl, it was all open and rolling all around and shit when I um, picked it up. I was mad, but hopefully... Um, that's not what goes on this time or nothing happens to it or anything. I just don't be trusting the airline. But, um, I'm really excited. I'm, I'm happy to get on out of here, get to my friends and have a good time and eat and things like that. So, you see my picture? I'm trying to be a grown lady and like decorate, but I'm leaving, but still. Um, yes, so period. I'm gonna see you guys at the airport. I'm gonna get to the airport really early. Our airport don't be packed, but I'm just gonna get there early because I really don't know if I pack too much stuff or anything like that. So I don't know. I just don't know. It can go a certain type of way. Um, because I went on there. And I have a bag, like if I took the bag, I know I can do a carry-on or whatever, so 
I feel like everything's gonna work out or whatever. So, a part of me really wants to buy a bigger suitcase when I'm down there. But anyway, yeah, period. Period. I'm got some egg rolls and an air fryer, honey, so I can have me a little snack. And um, yeah, so I'll see y'all guys uh, when I get to the airport. So I'm in the airport like an hour early. And I really wanted to see if they had like some Vaseline or something for me because I don't be liking to bring, um, I don't like to bring stuff like that because I don't know, the measurements be tearing your girl up and they be throwing my stuff away. So, I like to buy that stuff when I get there. But yeah, so I'm like an hour early. Um, I'm not gonna get on snacks or anything. I just ate. But yeah, so I'm here at my airport. They have like a um, bagel place. But our airport's small. See? But not too much. But yeah, so I'm excited. I'm trying to see what am I going to. Um, do when I first get down there because one of my friends said she want to go to um, like a hookah type spot where they got naked I'm looking for terminal 11 but uh, yeah so she said she might want to go to like a hookah spot or something and then oh they got Starbucks this young man said he want to take me somewhere too but you know the girls come first so, um, what I don't know, I don't think I want nothing because I got Chick fil A too. Mm -hmm. It's chilies for me. Do I want a little drink? I ain't gonna do it. It's not um, focusing good, but yeah. Oh, they got Burger King, bitch. Okay, Lil Rock. Okay. Chicken for life. And I got another little store. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Dang me, the back of the bus is giving Rosa Parks. I refuse to be put in the back. No, but it's time to seven. Okay, I found it. But yeah, so I'm actually finna to see where I could sit at. I don't know why I say um, Dallas bitch. That ain't where I'm going. Let me sit in a cut by myself. Let me get a vlogger. Ooh, bitch. One thing about it, two things for sure. I can tell y'all I'm tired of carrying bags. It's giving Erica Badu bag lady. And they are hurting my back. Carrying bags like that. Yeah. I guess nobody. Girl, I did that. Ooh, did I? Ooh. Oh, no, I did. I did. I did. I did. I did. Yeah. Yeah, I have to lay my wig back down myself because bitch, no tea, no shade. I done launched my store and everything, bitch. I wasn't finna pay to get no new wig. And I knew the girls down there would've got did my hair. I got friends down there that could do my hair. So I wasn't finna be worried about that or stunt that or nothing like that. So, but yeah, I'm excited. I'm ready. It's time to go. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. But yeah. Yeah, um, but my friend Shy, y'all know Shy, my best friend, she said she come in. Uh, attention in the concourse. If you recently came through the TSA screening checkpoint with a jacket that you no longer are wearing, please come back to the checkpoint to claim it. Once again, if you came through the checkpoint with a jacket that you are no longer wearing, please come back to the checkpoint to claim it. Boy. But why I didn't bring no got to be good or nothing? Look at me. Who is this girl I see staring straight back at me? 
Here's my nails. When will my Bitch. But yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready to flat iron my hair like a whore. I lied and said I was gonna do my makeup on the plane. Mm -hmm. I lied and said I was gonna do my makeup before I even came. Lie. To me, it just don't take me long enough to do my makeup to be doing all that. I'm not one of them. What's that that TikTok where they be patting themselves and you can hear the sound? I'm not one of them. It don't give that. My makeup don't take all that cookie bear. But yeah, so I'm gonna call my friend, my little homegirl, and wait on the plane. I really want something. I really want a little snack. But I don't need it. Um, yeah, so I'll see y'all when I'm gonna see y'all when um, I land. Really not when I land, cause I'm gonna be it's so hectic. At Atlanta Airport, I'm so scared low key. Um, but I'm gonna make it through. Girl, it gave me anxiety. Atlanta Airport gives me anxiety. I literally almost broke down last time, but. Cause I'm not city fired no more. It's giving country cornbread now. I don't be doing all that, but. Yeah, so. I don't think I'm gonna Please talk to y'all at the any airport. Suspicious activity or unattended baggage to law enforcement. I don't think I'm gonna. Uh, Por talk. favor, reporte a las autoridades cualquier actividad sospechosa o equipaje sin supervisión. I don't think I'm gonna talk to y'all. Veuillez signaler toute activité suspecte ou tout bagage laissé sous surveillance au service de sécurité. I don't think I'm gonna talk to y'all at the airport. I'm gonna talk to y'all at the Airbnb. Love you. Bye. Yeah, it was very stressful when I got here, bitch, because I didn't know where I was at. They done put me in the damn maze runner to stay. Maze runner. <laughs> Girl, I'm sitting up here. <laughs> just doing the fucking mo. No, but that's me, bitch. But the Airbnb is cute. Why the fuck do they got a YouTube? Why do they have a YouTube on the side? It's cute, bitch. It's us doing hookah in the bathroom. But yeah, friends, I just want to check in. Here. The beat is beating. Yeah. And um, we finna go to some called N Bar. And um, and I think it'll be fun. We gonna meet, you know, some people or whatever. So I'm gonna go have me a little good time, y'all. And I'll check back in with y'all. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, the dress. It was just like this. It's from the dollhouse. That class is hard. I feel like you need to. Yeah. I said, bitch, I'm. Do you not yeah. remember what? So, yeah. It's giving monochrome tees. I got two left feet. Let me be out But yeah, so, Girl, I'll let y'all know. I'll probably talk to y'all tomorrow for real. You know I lie all the time. But I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. It's so hard. It's literally the 26th at like almost midnight. See y'all. I just got back. Out the shower from the club. Wash my face the best I could. It's like almost four o'clock in the morning and I wanna tell you. I wanna hold on, I wanna drop y'all a little gym. Talk to y'all about tonight. Don't let no man feel like he can do it to you because he bought you some smile, 
Really anything. Because he bought you anything. Anything. Um, y'all just think like dating nowadays is so the filthy and disgusting. Like they to be so hung up on sex and stuff. It's like gross to me. So boom, let me tell y'all what happened. I'm drunk. Let me tell y'all what happened. Boom, went to the palace with that boy. He was cool. He was cool. Went to the palace. We had a good time. I liked him. I was liking on him real bad. Because I'm done. Y'all, while I was dancing and he touched my coochie. I reached back. I was like, don't do that. Like, don't do that. Then we had some sections, your friends promoter. So, you didn't pay for the section. So, I really don't understand why you acting like that. Right? Then, yeah, he bought me food, $25. But can I say something? The people was acting like the cash apps wasn't going through. I'm not saying that that's true, but that's what they gave. They was coming up to me on the slick like, oh, like, we need our payment. That don't got nothing to do with me, bitch. She said he was paying. Um, be for real. Um, but yeah, like, it was just kind of a turn off and disgusting how it gave like oh I was gonna be doing this and doing that because this boy bought me some because that's all that boy down to I don't know that boy he didn't buy my friends like way in and shit like that like he don't have to do anything he's not obligated to anything as an adult man but I don't care if he bought the Eiffel Tower. I still want to get him no Gucci. Because it's just like, please relax. But yeah, I'm drunk. So, my eyes is really closing. And I, I don't know. I just feel like I'm, it's not time to talk. But I had to give y'all that little situation that happened. But I talked to y'all tomorrow. Period. Anyway, the camera be doing stupid stuff. But yeah, it's 5.30 the next day. Good morning. <laughs> you hear your girl voice? Um, yeah. So, I'm about to actually go with Shy to um, this bar club type of thing. I'm taking y'all with me because we are doing better this year. And I'm really scared to move this because my lens messed up. Okay. But yeah, so I'm taking y'all with me and everything. And, um, I'm not really wearing no makeup because, I mean, I'm just not. I'm going to put some on tonight. I don't, I'm not a big makeup girl. Um, so I don't, I don't really wear makeup like that. Thank God. But, like I'm saying, thank God that my skin has came a long way. I used to feel like that. But, no, I don't really wear, wear makeup. So, yep, I'm just going to flat iron my hair. I'm just going to put on a little jumpsuit because I'm getting real cute tonight. No need to do the most. I get cute tomorrow, but I'm still probably not during the daytime. I don't really see myself wearing makeup during the strip, unless we go to like a day party or brunch or some shit. But yeah, so I'm just about to do that, and then I will come back on here and tell y'all. I mean, and show y'all. I'm really not gonna show y'all nothing. I'm just come back at the when I'm in the car with shy. This looks terrible, but. I don't want to take my camera off the little tripod thing that it's on because girl it just be too much. But I'm really just here to talk, bitch, because my I went up I watched the video I made last night. <laughs> I didn't even re remember making it. Um But yeah, because that really bothered me. Um, that that boy would touch my vagina like that. I mean, I think that a lot of men are predatory. Like they be, they be doing like preying on people, and I and I feel like that's weird because, like, it's really the mindset of like, and mind you, 
Mind you, I did not hit him up. Swear. He had just saw um my husband, this is hurting. Yeah, I didn't hit him up. He had saw on my Instagram story that I said I was packing. And I remember telling him a long time ago that I was coming down here because we were supposedly like, you know, kind of texting at a point. Anyway, so I, yeah, so we was texting. So I told him a long, I've had this ticket and everything like ready for like a month and a half, no shade. Um, because Southwest just had a sale, so I just went and bought the ticket to Atlanta because coming to Atlanta ain't nothing for me. Like, I don't need nobody to come with me. Like, these my friends, like, you know. So, anyway, yeah, so I was with, you know, went to the club. He hit me up. I did not hit him up. That's my, I, that's important in the story. That's important in the story because... I don't come across to you like I need you to buy me nothing, like I need anything, like I'm going to have a good time regardless, so I don't know why dudes be trying to come at me with that type of mentality like I'm going to do something or I'm going to be so whoop de doo to like hunt you or like do anything to you sexually because you bought me something. And I really don't think I give poor vibes. I don't think I give the vibes like I've never been nowhere. I don't think I give the vibes like I don't have nothing. So I don't know why. I don't know why I do ever just approach me like that. Right? That's that's what I'm trying to say. I I don't get that. So, um, and mind you, we weren't even talking like we weren't even like texting like that. Like it didn't go anywhere. So I didn't hit him up when I got off the plane or whatever. So, let me get my phone. He saw in my story that I was packing. He was like, oh, where are you going? I was like, well, you know I'm coming up there. Like, no shade. It's like, bitch, you don't got nothing else going on for real. Don't sit up there and act like you, uh, don't sit up there and play, okay? Like, you just got all this stuff going on and you just forgot. Anyway, that's why you said something. Because I didn't say nothing to you. So, yeah, so, anyway, he did that, um, and I told him, like, yeah, I'm actually here, or whatever, like, just, you know, landing and shit, and he was like, oh, okay, shit, um, you know, when you get settled, like, you and your homegirls, like, first he said just me and him, which I am so, 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 so grateful that I didn't just go with him by myself. Which is something that I wasn't going to do anyway because, like I said, I don't know him like that. We didn't have a lot of conversation. We really didn't converse when we exchanged numbers like that. We just kind of here and there. And no shade, his conversation was a little weird anyway. So, it wasn't like I was promptly giving a fuck about what he was saying. Am I supposed to shake this bitch? Why is that got that in there? Oh, it says shake well, bitch. But, um, yeah, so, um, he was like, yeah, let's, let's go out and let's do something. Like, oh, yeah, we gonna, I don't leave till tomorrow morning. And, girl, let me tell you what he was doing at first, bitch. So, at first, he said he had to go do some shit from work the same time I was gonna be here. So, to me, I'm just like, oh, too bad. Like, I'm not gonna see you. The fuck? So, he's like, oh, well, um, now, oh, he was like, oh, well, you need to just stay extra days and, just stay some extra days. Bitch for a nigga I don't know. From the internet. Stay extra days. Anyway. So I was like child please. Like didn't even pay him no mind for real. And so. Um, then. Um, sorry y'all. Let me, let me catch myself. So yeah, so he asked me to stay these extra days. I'm like, boy, please. And I didn't, uh, you know, entertain that idea. And he obviously, he wasn't even, he wasn't talking no money either. Talking about staying extra days and all this. And, oh, do you got to miss work? And, but you wasn't talking about making up for that. You just asking dumb questions. So I'm already peeping he a flex anyway. You see what I'm saying? So I don't care what you post on the internet. I'm going to figure out what's really going on. 
easily too. So I'm like, boy, I know you probably do this all the time to young ass girls. You know what I'm saying? You could tell when dudes entertain young girls or young minded girls or just girls that don't have nothing to their name or don't have nothing going on because they just show it. They they do dumb shit like that. So, um, of course, I didn't, you know, I told him I was going to say the extra days and then I didn't uh, talk to him. Like, we just wasn't talking. It was no big deal. We didn't fall out or nothing. Our conversation just wasn't flowing like that. Like, it wasn't given for me. Who the fuck is this? Hello? Hey. Hey. What's the, um, what's the plan for this week? Do what? What's your schedule looking like? What's your schedule looking like? Um, I'm actually, I'm about to go eat with my best friend and then I'm going to, um, I'm going to eat, eat NRE or something like that for my other friend's birthday. It used to be something else. It, um, I, but I went there. It's like by where you used to live at. That's why, because when I was there yesterday, I was like, damn. This used to be Buckhead, Buckhead Saloon or something. I don't know. It used to be something else. Oh, yeah, that shit burned down. That shit burned the fuck down. That's why. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Because I was like, damn, this is a, such a familiar area. But, yeah, so I'm going there for my friend's birthday. But really, tomorrow, like, the whole day, I really don't have nothing to do. All right. If I can't get up with you tonight, I'll get you tomorrow, then. Okay, boo. If y'all gonna be in the neighborhood, just let me know what bar you're at or Mike below. Oh, for sure, for sure. So, I'll text you. We'll, we're gonna meet up at 10, and then, uh, you still live in the same area? Yeah. Okay. So, I'll text you around 10, just so you can know ahead of time, like, exactly what we gonna do, so you can come meet us. You're a fucking best. Thank you. Of course. So, but I still wanna see you tomorrow. I don't really wanna see you in the club. I got you. We'll, we'll do it right. Right, period. <laughs> See, that's my little bookie boo right there. He is so smart. Um, he's a very nice guy. I don't know what type of niggas niggas think I like. I don't like niggas like that. I don't like I like me a little accountant type nigga. I don't really I don't know, I don't like that type of shit. So but anyway, um yeah. Um so the other nigga from last night, he Sitting up there, um, being weird and lying and acting like he got this and he got that and he doing this and he doing that like bitches is green. And I'm just looking at him like, boy, please. So I finally get down. He's talking about, oh, we need to do something just the two of us. We need to do something just the two of us. And da da da. -da. And I'm like, oh well, my friends coming to meet me. You know, like giving that type of vibe. Oh, my friends coming to meet me. Like I don't know and whatever. But he was like, yeah. So. They can come and send a pitch, pictures of niggas like, oh, what your friends look like. We're fucking 30. We're 30, are we? Is Like, it was giving child, like, from the whole beginning part. Because it's like, so what? I'm supposed to, what my friends supposed to be ready and prepared to, like, be cute to be hit on by your fucking friends? Why is it just not? Adults getting together. Why do it have to be? Oh, what do they look like? What do they look like? Bitch, you're not finna get nothing up off now one of the bitches I hang out with. I don't hang out with hoes like that. So, and all of that shit. And nowadays they talk about, oh, slut shaming. I do. I shame men and women because at the end of the day, it's the limit for every motherfucking thing. No, I ain't gonna say I shame. I look at it a certain type of way. In my own, I'm not gonna tell overtly like tell another person that's OD. But I look at it, bitch, sit down. How is a man supposed to marry you and you, how are you going to get married? How are you going to use it to lock in a man if it won't even lock into me? You know what I'm saying? But anyway, it was giving childish because he's like, oh, what she look like? And then it was another girl coming that was my home girlfriend and I, you know, I don't know her. Um, I didn't know her. Now I do. And I really like her. She's a sweet girl, but he talking about some, oh, what's her Instagram? I said, I don't know. I don't know her. Like, I said, is it a problem? He like, no, oh, my bad. Like, what the fuck? Like, no, bitch, I don't know her Instagram. Grown ass man, like, what the fuck? So, 
Then we get there. He was nice. I would not lie. He was nice or whatever. He paid for me to get in or he said he did. And then this, uh, he got me and uh, the girl. One of my friends was not drinking. And so um, he got the friend that was drinking like shots and stuff, which was very nice. You know, he didn't have to do that. But at the end of the day, it was an end goal. You wasn't doing it to be a nice man. You was doing it to think I was going to drop my drawers for you because you bought us a few shots. It was really three shots and he was very slow motion with them too. It wasn't like he was just buying them and buying them. But he's supposed to be this rich ass nigga. He talking about, oh, I own uh, this bar. I'm part ownership in this strip club and this and uh, 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 all this bullshit. I could change the way this is angled because I got my shirt on now. Period. But yeah, he doing all that, doing all this. And I'm just like, what's the emoji when a man just standing there? That's me. Like, what? So, um, we we go to the first spot. Now, this is the first cash app card dilemma that he had. Let me get my jewelry. So, boom. <laughs> so, boom. Bitch, we go to uh, the little spot or whatever. We go to the spot. Everything cool. Everything's lit. And this dude walks up to our group and was like, I need to take pictures of y'all. Or like, let me take some pictures of y'all. And so he takes some dope pictures. He takes some dope pictures and um, he say they $40. So I'm like, bitch, okay. I'm missing one bracelet. I'm like, okay, cool. So the dude's like, no, 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 I don't pay for that. Like, I got you. Like, no, nah, shorty, like, da, da, da. I'm like, oh, okay. So he paid for the dude, and I'm like, I could use these for my website. I'm like, oh, thank you for that, or whatever. Mind you, mind you, I'm 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 getting a little attracted. He, you know, I'm like, oh, okay, like, all right, you know, all right, type shit. I'm, Cause I'm like, this is nice, that's cool, or whatever, right? So, um, I really can just take y'all. I have this position, but I'm gonna just take y'all because I don't want to keep picking up where I'm, you know, talking about shit. So yeah, so. He brings us, I mean, he comes and uh, pays for the pictures. That's what he say now. Why the photographer man on Instagram still writing me right the foot now about the pictures? Literally, the next day, talking about that the dude didn't give him the money. Why? Tell me why. Tell me if somebody explain that to me why. Why is I had to give I gave the picture to his Instagram this morning. I said, baby, this is him. Cause you're not about to keep sending me question marks and all that shit about forty dollars. And no shade, I don't know. I don't know if some of y'all feel like I should have paid it. No. No. Because okay, let me say why. The reason why I was like, I'm not finna just pay the forty dollars is because the picture man approached had me fucked up okay because at the end of the day you went up to him and y'all had a whole conversation and y'all talked and you came back to me you came back to me like saying okay the picture's paid for it's ready to go right so why would i that's your fault as a business and why are you getting mad at me and talking shit to me when you took your grown ass over there and and y'all was over there talking i saw you nodding your head and everything shaking hands and shit like he done paid you bro i don't broke this necklace bitch oh Y'all yeah, broke my little niggas from the dollhouse. Rip. But anyway, um, yeah, like, why are you acting like that with me? All hardcore and shit. Like, I'm the one. You went over there and supposedly handled your business. Um, I don't see what I was supposed to do. Do y'all think I'm wrong? You can tell the truth. Like, if you think, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because if y'all think I'm wrong, then let me know. But I wasn't finna pay 
and you over there talking and chopping it up. But anyway, so that happened, bitch, where the, the, the picture man was like, I didn't get no payment and I need the screenshot and all this type of shit. And I'm like, like I said, I directed him to him. And um, told him, you could ask about it yourself, man to man, and stop harassing me about it. So, um, anyway, then we go to another spot. Okay, this is what the part that kind of pisses me off. Not pisses me off, but it's just typical. You know what I'm saying? Like, everything, the whole situation is just so fucking typical. Like, so boom. So, we come... And we get to the um, place, the second. We go to another club. We get to the second club. And um, he like, oh, this is my, the boy that we was with, one of the boys that we was with, talking about, oh, the next place we going. Oh, then we standing up, you know, in our heels. We standing there. We standing there. And the one dude is like, oh, well, we need to get a section. This ain't cutting it. They asked me, did we get one? No. Bitch, now I feel like I don't know where my card is. But long story short, bitch, we did not get no section, okay? Period. Can I tell y'all something about myself? I am not irresponsible. Do you see how, do you see how I said, I think I lost my debit card, but I did not panic? Something about myself that I, I don't give a fuck. Nobody will ever make me stop screaming this from the rooftop. I am not no irresponsible bitch. I do not lose shit. I don't be girl, period. Got it. <laughs> I didn't even, I knew I didn't do no dumb shit like that. Leave my damn card. Girl, please. But anyway, so we didn't get the um, section. Mind you, we still setting up. And then... Um, we go to the next spot. He was sweet. We got a boot on the car at, at the spot we was at. He was nice. He waited on us or whatever so we could make sure we got in at the next spot. Like I said, he was doing kind gestures, but to me, it didn't seem like he was just doing it to do it at the end. So, girl, so he did that. He gave, you know, he <laughs> did that. Then we went and went to the thing. Mind you, okay, all over his page, he be talking about. Like, he drives, like, these exotic cars and all this type of shit. And he got this and he got that. And, bitch, he was in a Mustang. Mind you, I'm walking. So, it's not a read because I don't even have a car. Like, I don't want a car. I feel like it's an unnecessary bill for the place I'm at in my life. You know, I do wish one day that y'all get there. No, I'm just playing. But, I do. I don't really need it. So, I haven't. I'm not getting one. So, um... I haven't, you know, it is what it is. But long story short, um, he had a Mustang. So we get in the car, we in the Mustang. Why this man gonna say, oh, I'm just driving this car and for right now. And it's just like, what's up with all the cap in this generation? Like, is it really that serious? Like, is it really that deep to people to be seen in a certain light? Like, I really never, I don't know. I've never really been like that. Like, I can't believe the way people put on a whole persona and be a whole different person. Like, and then the takeaway is that they literally just did it for nothing. Because what are you getting? I don't know. Not no Gucci for me. But anyway, so yeah. So we get to the next spot or whatever. And um, uh, that's when he started acting a fool. So we get to another spot. The the dude is a promoter, so you didn't pay for the session. The session was free. Okay. Um, then he got a bottle. You know, one bottle. Okay, that's fine. Thank you, whatever. Grateful. We having a good time. We chilling. And then I'm like really like a person like interactive, like touchy. So I'm like, okay, he was being sweet. I'm like, okay, he seemed cool. So we all, you know, I'm kind of leaning on him. I'm like, hey, giving boo, it's giving this my little boo, whatever. Girl, so here we go, another cash app incident. It comes to the uh, food. So when it comes to the food, he, um, 
When it comes to the food, the girl was like, um, we do cash app, I play boo boo, so I tell him. And he, they always had to loop around and come back and ask him some else or, and was looking at him a little crazy like, and he just like, oh, just hold on her. I don't know, it just seemed broke. Like, my homegirl bought her own food. The girl got her payment and was gone. She didn't come back and ask her shit. She didn't come back and do shit. She didn't say the word payment no more. So, I don't know. And, um, yeah. So, that happened. And then that's is when he started being really weird. So, this is when he started talking about, did you see where I walked across the street from? And I'm like, no. And he was like, yeah, I was with the cops. You know, I'm Homeland Security. What? I said, oh, okay. Then he literally took my hand and put it on his waist. He had a gun. Okay. It was like the weirdest shit ever. So you own all these clubs and these bars and you're an artist and you're all and then the art The art really let me know that he was a little off to me. I'm sorry. I don't give a fuck what nobody say the art was like sex like people Getting ate out and Bodies of women and shit like that. That means you ain't getting no cat to me. I don't care That's how I feel and I feel like you're weird He didn't post no he had no other art anyway so then you know we at the spot everything cool we chilling and girl i'm you know i'm just dancing i'm a dancing ass girl okay i dance when i go out if you don't dance when you go out then i don't know but i dance i be woo, 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 woo. so i'm dancing i'm giving the girls why he literally took his um hand and put it under my dress and i literally felt like he grabbed my coochie like grabbed it grab my shit and i turned around i'm like don't touch me like that like you tripping so then it just all was downhill in my eyes and i didn't even want him around me and i didn't yeah it was over with after that because i'm like you're a fucking sicko and you're weird well who reaches a hand up a bitch they just met dress so i was ready to go after that then um i tell him he's like well when you leave i leave and i'm leaving with you i said why would you think that why would you what you mean he's talking about, oh well I'm, I'm going where you go you know because we have to break down the why that he thinks that you see what i'm saying we have to break down the why so your why to why a bitch that you don't you didn't really talk to before this comes here flies herself this i'm paying for everything okay you think that because we met when I already had plans with other people, we met, you came, we we all did that. You bought maybe three, four shots, forty dollar picture, maybe spent roughly one eighty. That that means that when I leave, you leave. Get the fuck out of my face. Period. Are you dumb, bitch? No. I'm like no, like no, we're not doing that. So he's like, oh, okay, okay. I'm like, yeah, I'm finna go take a shot. I said, you know, I'm finna go lay down. Mind you, mind you, this is yesterday when I got here. So I'm I, I traveling. I just got here. I'm coming out. And then you're talking about some, I'm supposed to lay down, which, kid, are you dumb? Girl, please. I would never do no dusty ass shit like that. And it really disrespected me that he even was given like that was even an option or like that was something I would be on. Like, boy, get the fuck out of here. So, boom. I told him I'm leaving or whatever. So, I leave. Shit, I left with the people I came with. I didn't come with you. So, we left. And so, we left. And then this thing starts blowing my phone up, blowing my phone up, blowing my phone up. I'm like, you're an idiot. So, I just didn't answer the phone. Then he texted me talking about say less. You really believe I owed you some cat for that? In your heart of hearts? You thought I owed you some pussy? You're a weird. You're so weird. So weird. And then he said he had to go out of town for um 
work or whatever. So he gone. He know he knew he was never gonna fucking see me again. That's what makes it weirder. You trying to shove yourself down my throat. People weird, bro. Niggas are weird. Weird. But yeah, so that's the story time on that. I don't know why this is acting like I can't record a certain amount. It's I, I probably never paid attention to the numbers on here. But yeah, so that girl, this talking about it exceeded the limit. Bitch, if I told that story and they uh cut it up, let me check what they did. Okay, the story is there. It's like bitch, because I was gonna ask who I'm who is they? I'm talking about the camera. Who is they? But yeah, so that's what happened and it was weird. But uh yeah, so I'm really gonna see y'all when I leave with y'all now. Period. Yeah, please don't play with it, bitch. Y'all know who it is. <laughs> Motherfucking shot, bitch. Be bae, be I ain't gonna show Deja. Big motherfucking bitch. Deja sleep. <laughs> Big bang. She wore me out yesterday. Period. And tomorrow we doing again. Cause oh, ain't your friend birthday? Night, well, I'm going to that. That's why I said we need to rejuvenate today. I just needed one day. Yeah. yeah. That bitch, but we finna. She needs 16 hours. I'm gonna watch what she needs. She needs 28 hours. Yeah. <laughs> y'all, I had a good little time. I recorded my food, but I'm gonna show y'all. How much y'all put? They got me to pick one. Put one. Or two. I don't wanna get a copyright claim. Hold on. Um, but yeah, bitch. We went to the little place. I'ma put that part in here and everything like that. But bitch, we drinking a little bit. They say they don't fuck with me, but I say I don't fuck with me. Yeah, look at y'all. Ball it there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Move on here. Bitch, I ain't about to get in my hair long now. At the I top. But I. Don't matter. That's why you're in the top. The fuck? We're going to the bottom. I'm bald all around. So, who am I to speak? Yeah. I'm just bald head. I'm just a bald head bitch. I'm not. There's no hair. You got like Ren Stimpy. No. Okay. Yeah. Now. And I'm finna shave my head bald to start over again. Yeah. That's fine too. They I say like, they don't fuck with me, but I say they can't fuck with me. Shit. <laughs> y'all, y'all ain't seen Shaw since Miami. And Morax is fine. And Morax is cute. Yeah, y'all ain't seen. Who is Morax? Right, Rufus. A mole rat yeah. is cute. Yeah, more rats are cute. Okay, maybe she ain't got mad. You don't think a more rat cute? No, ma'am. <sighs> the name itself pisses me off. Cause it's a mole rat. That's somebody else gave it his name. It don't mean that they decided they didn't make their name mole rat. Are you touching that with your hands? Yeah, it's the cold one. Bitch, you ain't never. Hose is barbaric. Hose you know how to barbaric. Yeah. Barbaric. You get real, you get real <laughs> barbaric. You get real barbaric when you know how to goddamn smoke this. No, for real. Ain't no goddamn game. You come in at six o'clock in the morning like this bitch. Puffing on zooties. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, but y'all, y'all know I don't be doing all that. Um, period. Yeah, I'm gonna yeah, two or two or see y'all tomorrow. I don't feel like we're gonna talk no more today. Period. My nails eat. It's time. Uh, hey, we finna go somewhere. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, we finna go somewhere, beach. Um, yeah, that's all I have to say. We finna go somewhere. It's active. Let's get active, little baby. Show my outfit to my friend, my people. Okay. Oh, oh damn. But that's <laughs> you can't see that you showing me here. Flip it down. It's split. Okay. Yeah. Wait, you on oh, always record already. Oh. Hey, hey, yo, 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 yo. Why she put this on the worldwide motherfucking wet bitch? <laughs> yeah. Cause y'all don't know no better. And don't. Ah, you look a mess. Hi Not guys. Right. It's Sunday, January the uh 29th, and I'm in the bed. It's like eleven. 16 in Atlanta and baby I was down all Saturday Saturday I just kind of watched movies had the little hookah um chilled in the house but yes today's Sunday 
And I'm probably just going to go with my friends to get something to eat. And I'm really going to take y'all with me this time. But I just don't be want to take my camera places where I don't be drinking and everything. So, and the way I was down for a whole day, um, the way I was down for a whole day yesterday, I'm not drinking no more on the trip because I'm just not. I'll probably be like, have me a drink, but like drinking, like how I was drinking, I'm not doing that no more. Um... Yeah, so today I'm probably gonna meet with my friend Shy again and my friend Dimitri. Um, we're gonna go get something to eat and just chill or whatever. So, like I said, I'm gonna take y'all with me because we're not gonna be doing like no club or nothing like that. So, um, yeah, I'm trying to think, but I said one o'clock. Um, but if they don't be ready at one or whatever. I'm probably still just going to go to Atlantic Station by myself just to walk around and go get out or whatever. Because that's what I said I want to do. And then my last full day here is tomorrow. Um, I really might go to my friend Dominique house today. I probably would just go over there and sit with him later tonight. Um, but I don't think I'll be going out, out no more. So, um, yeah. But we'll see. We never know. We never know. We never know what it gives. Um, but, yeah. So, um, yeah, I'll see y'all later. My phone started saying it was dying, so I have to vlog the old school way on my other phone. I mean, the camera said it was dying, but this is my fix. I don't know. I, I like, I don't really have a lot of tennis shoes, but I thought those were cute because I'm having a red purse. They're khaki, whatever. Um, but yeah, so I'm heading downstairs to go to this Rihanna Fenty event and, um, Atlantic Station to shop. And, um... Period. So I'll see y'all there. I was gonna go to the Rihanna thing. But girl, let me show y'all sorry. My camera battery went dead. But look at this line, bitch. And that's one side. The other side is on the other. It go way down. But I can't flip the camera while I'm recording to show y'all. But yeah, it goes way down. So I might just go to like H&M or something because I'm going to wait on Shy to go eat or whatever and she already sent me the she already sent me the place she want to go but this just one side of the line that's just one side it's like goes down on the other side too so I don't know but it did start at 11 so maybe I should have been here right at 11 bit but I feel like the reason that um the line so long is because Cash App is doing it and it's also um they're giving away stuff. So, yeah. Probably just gonna shop around for a little while. And then, yeah. So, I'll check back into it with y'all when shopping here. So, we are at Azotia. Azotia. <laughs> Period. Look at Sha. Shabuya. Sha, Sha, Shabuya. Roll call. <laughs> My name is Yeah, she hella fine. Yeah, don't want no Disney. Yeah, she can give me to be mad. Oh, I like that. I'm putting the lines in here. Okay, I'm going. We're going to do a flight of shots. Yeah. yeah. So, but I'll show y'all my food and everything when it comes out. Shrimp taco. <laughs> yeah. And shot guys. They, um, a lime brain, a salad, or some shit like that. Yep. And, this and buzz buzz. some fries on the side. Yeah. Yeah. Crispy. Yeah. <laughs> And I'm guessing I just forgot my charger for my um, camera. So crazy. Um, but yeah, so I forgot it. So, but thank God I got my other phone. Um, but what I'm about to do today is my last day here. Um, I'm just going to, my friend Deja left her hookah. I'm gonna do hookah, honey. I figured out how to put it. I actually want one at my house now. Never did hookah in a club, was never gonna do hookah. But I actually like it, it gives a little bit like, hookah kinda gives, so I'm becoming a hookah hottie. But yeah, I'm definitely gonna get one when I get home. Period, I hooked it up myself today. I'm getting outrageous with the hookahs, right? But yeah, I'm ordering some Taco Mac, I haven't had Taco Mac in years, getting some wings from them. I have to go downstairs to get it, which is irritating, but I'm gonna go downstairs to get it. And I need to find out what I did with the little key anyway. But yeah, so that's what I'm doing today. I will probably will check back in if anything exciting happens. But yeah, this is probably going to be like my chill day since I leave tomorrow. 
but yeah so just checking in grow bye i had to cancel my order <clears throat> and well they canceled my order i don't know what happened but i got some from porsche uh um, baby daddy restaurant we're gonna see what it's in for the hot dog factory so i got me a hot dog and some wings and i got that mystery drink so we're gonna see what that's hitting on when it get here <clears throat> and i think that'll be a little bit more fun so let me get the girls a foodie hey porsche baby daddy is looking good so i got the american dog the um wings the fire wings and I, they come with fries and then i got their mystery drink who cool. you really don't know what it is but it looks like it's some strawberries floating in there um but yeah it looks really good and i'm gonna try it and let y'all know if it's good so it's tuesday um i think the 31st and i'm leaving i'm getting my stuff all together to get out of here um so i'm gonna show you guys the airbnb like i said my camera i believe i left my charger i hope i did um, so I'm going to, well, I have more at home, but still, but I'm going to show you guys, I'm going to show you guys the Airbnb or whatever. Um, yeah, I just got in the shower, so I'm about to get ready to go and I'm going to show y'all the Airbnb. The food was good. Portia husband or Portia baby daddy food was good. All my friends was just coming over saying bye and everything got a little hectic. So yeah, I didn't get to like do it right over, like right then. So I'm going to show you guys the Airbnb from walking in, you know, whatever like that. And then, yeah, but I like this Airbnb. It was really centrally located, like by everything or whatever. And um, it's really pretty. Like I like it. So I'll show you. It's this long hallway right here. I'm about to close my suitcase back. And then they have this cute mirror, very cute setup. I didn't use any of that stuff. They already had waters and stuff in the refrigerator, which was really nice. And I love the bedroom. I'm not making the bed because I feel like, you know, they're going to wash the sheets or whatever. Um, but yeah, so this is the bedroom. So cute. And then what I love about it is it has these barn doors. So, I mean, in the daytime when I was a hungover bitch, I slid that motherfucking clothes and it was dark in here, like pitch black, like it was nighttime. So I appreciated that. And then this is the bathroom with just, you know, the little shower, whatever, and the closet, which the only negative was that, um, let me put their pillows back. I'll do that in a minute. The only negative was they had like ants coming from the floor right here. And kind of on the nightstand, so it was like ants in my, like right here too. So it was like ants in my luggage, bitch. So I didn't like that. But really, that's the only thing. But I'm sure that's like an apartment problem and not like a problem on the owner. I'm not finna. And then they're black, so I'm not finna put that in my thing. Like, bitch, it's not that deep. Um. So, yeah. Um. I really enjoyed it. Like I said, it's centrally located. It's on 14th Street. Um. You know, if you from Atlanta, know Atlanta, House of Hookah. I could walk there like it's right across the street that's where it is on 14th atlantic station is like not even a mile behind me when i when i was ubering over there all we did was hit two corners and we right there so it was really 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 good so i recommend it or whatever i'm not going to put the link because like i said i kind of want to make this like <laughs> i kind of want to make this like the place that i come to because like i said i really liked it you had to do so much to get into the building um, it was kind of agitating going to get people, but I don't care. I would rather go get people than be in here feeling like somebody going to come get me. So, yeah. And I enjoyed it, and I loved it, and um, I will be back. Bitch. So, I'm actually going to wrap up everything, close my luggage back, and head to the airport, and then I'll talk to y'all to the airport. My camera is dead. I don't have the charger, so I'm just going to show you my food so I can eat it. I'm here early. It looks so, so, so good. I feel like I'm going to go to sleep on the plane. Um, but yeah, so I'll show you guys, and then I'm eating. And this is from... Oh, I don't even think it says the name. Hold on. I don't know. I think it's called Grape. I don't know. I've had to put it on here. I'll put it in here in words. 